The formalization process this morning at the Airways Hotel involved senior executive members across all private and public sectors of the oil and gas industry. The EITA mechanism ensures that companies in the extractive industries disclose payments made to the government with the government disclosing the corresponding receipts. Treasury Minister Don Poilet chaired the meeting saying the implementation of EITI will be done face by face starting with the national government. It gives me a lot of comfort um, and energy to uh, drive a transparency uh, further, a step further from uh, what we have already done and achieved because of the overwhelming support um, and the enthusiasm I see coming from uh, every stakeholder, especially the big uh, investors, which I value very much. Uh. Polia says the implementation will involve companies from the extractive industries and national civil society organizations. A draft memorandum of understanding was read out with a move to accept the MOU. This was followed by signing of different members of all industrial sectors and civil society. I like to call on Papua New Guineans the transparency is indivisible as good governance. Uh, it is, we've got to have that. We've got to have transparent systems and procedures. We have to have people in custodian over those systems of delivery. They've got to be transparent. The Treasury Minister then officially closed the meeting and called on the industry and civil society organizations to nominate their representatives to the PNG EITI MSG. Jack Lapave Jr., National MTV News.